Hey everyone, today I want to show you a function in Google Sheets on how you identify the week number. So, so I have a bunch of different dates here that are, you know, just random dates and tied to some other data. But let's say I need to know which week number these these dates fell within throughout the year, which obviously it can be different applications if you're trying to look up, you know, the different sales by week or whatnot. It's helpful to know. It's a very simple function, so we're just going to go equals week num we'll hit tab there and then we'll just click on the date so Google she's obviously just kind of does that for us and then we can just do close parentheses and hit enter and then that's going to give us the week number in the year so there's something else we can do we can add a comma here and it's going to give us the opportunity to add a different type so when we do it as is it's defaulting that sunday is the first day of the week however if we want to do uh, two that will indicate that that monday would be the first day of the week and so it just alters what day of the week you want to use so you can see before it was six but now it's uh, week number seven just based on that change in when where our calculation is showing when the week starts. So typically, we're going to be using that Sunday as the first day of the week, but uh, in some instances, you might not want to do that. You might want to do other days of the week, but we're going to go ahead and just do one, and so you'll see, so that's going back to Sunday. Uh, you can do Sunday, you can leave it blank, and that will just be the default, but you also have that opportunity to go in and alter that. So we're going to stick with this for now, and then we'll just do our autofill. And again, it's going to show us all of the, the week numbers for the dates that we have selected here. So very easy to use, but can also be a very powerful and helpful tool in Excel. And I hope this was, was helpful. Please let me know in the comments below. And please let me know if there's any other videos that you'd like me to, to make or there's any questions or concerns here. But please subscribe to the Excel guy and uh, have a great day.